To start us off, who is your favorite basketball player of all time, man or woman? Favorite basketball player of all time, Michael Jordan, for like sure. Um, his drive, his like dominance, the way he just dominated the game and changed the game, um, his competitiveness, like I always felt like he was just somebody that just was just a beast on the floor, so he's my favorite of all time. Did you see the last dance? It became personal with me. Oh, yes. I was, times. Yeah, a hundred <laughs> times. I still watch it when I want to be inspired. I loved it so much. And it was so nostalgic because it like brought you right back to when you were in that time frame of watching him and living it. Oh, I loved it so much. Who was your favorite basketball player of all time? Um, everybody loves Michael Jordan, which I did as well. Magic Johnson was my favorite player, though. I just love the way he passed, the way he like, smiled, moving the ball around, fun all the time. Looking at your staff, if we did like most likely to succeed, most likely to become president someday, who would that be on your staff? Oh, my staff? Yes. Maybe Carol Owens, because <laughs> she's wise. Um, she um, has so much, so much guidance and wisdom and experiences, so I think that she would be able to be a great president. First, first lady, first bad woman. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Maybe hey, Grady Eifert. Very unassuming, really hard worker, has a good person. Gets along with everybody. If you were not a basketball coach, what would you have wanted to be for your career? Uh, I have, I have no other skills. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I would have wanted to be. I don't know if anybody would want me to do anything but coach basketball. I, I had a feeling you were not going to have a good answer for that. You are bas That's your hobby. That's your life. It is. Nothing yes. wrong with that. You picked the right job then. Did pick the right job. It might have picked me. I'm going to give you the hardest question of all right now. <laughs> so the most rewarding job you've ever had in your life, coaching, motherhood, or grandmotherhood? Ooh, motherhood, but then grandmotherhood's right, <laughs> like, right next to it. <laughs> but yeah, just having a son, but also watching my son have a son has been amazing. Awesome. You survived it. Oh, great. <laughs> yes. Oh, those cheeks on that baby. Of course, Neil's son, Jaden Ivey, is currently playing for the Detroit Pistons, and it's been a big year for him. The former Mishawaka Marion Knight had his first child, Noah James, with his wife, college sweetheart, former Purdue volleyball player, Caitlin Newton. And oh my goodness. <laughs> that baby is just so cute. Talking to Niel, she's just beams with pride when she talks about Jaden. And of course, their relationship has been so well documented. An incredible mother son relationship. Yes, she should. And something cool to point out Micah talked about his coach, his assistant coach, Grady Eifert. Grady is a former Purdue basketball player. And he's the brother of former Notre Dame tight end Tyler Eifert. I know, how cool is that? And of course, their <laughs> other brother, Griffin, is a current player for the Notre Dame football yeah, team. Darn cool. So I have a feeling we might have a story on that coming up in football season on ABC 57 <laughs> kickoff. And speaking of Boilermakers, coming up later on this season, I'll actually have a special fast break with Purdue Boilermakers head coach Matt Painter. You don't want to miss that one.